It's jail for you. And I hope you rot there. What? what? Hello, yeah. everybody. Welcome back to Kingdom Come. It's been a while since I've done a video about this, but uh, we're yeah. going to be doing something with the good old horsey boys. Uh, specifically, how you can actually use horses as one of the most dangerous weapons ever. Uh, because I've seen before that somebody was talking about that like, you can't kill people by running into them. Like, you know, you can kind of go like this and you give them a nice boop. Yeah! Are you blind for Christ's sake? There's people walking here. Yeah, so basically people get mad at you when you hit them, sort of thing. But, you know, they don't really die, right? Um, that's not entirely true. So we're going to be talking about... <laughs> about the using horses to kill a bunch of people. And, um, you might be wondering, is that what is this? Why is there just a ton of horses everywhere uh stacking here <laughs> why is there two happy boys here too <laughs> uh they're the newest merchants here in rate um <laughs> don't mind them oh god um <laughs> they're kind of just stuck there forever to sell stuff um i kind of stolen every single horse off the map that's uh well most of the horses i should say i stolen every named horse out here so we got roach war horse Jetta, we got Pegasus. Oh yes, we got we got all the favorites like Well, it, whatever that's name, Bayard. Yeah, we got all the favorites here. And so it's fantastic. So I thought I'd bring them out to watch. These are just regular horses here, so they don't really matter as much, but they still want to see the show. So I mean, the thing is with horses, once you steal them, they never go back to the pre previous spot they were at. Look at good old Kelpie. Uh, I believe for my last playthrough of the pacifist run, Kelpie just lived here forever and um, continues to live here. So, but anyways, uh, yeah, so we got all the good favorites here and I thought I'd bring them out here to watch. Uh, so <laughs> this is perfectly good fun. So we're going to do some good fun times here. Specifically, we're going to talk about like what, you know, what can you do with actually the horses? Can you actually kill people yeah. with your horse? Um, Sure, because a lot of times people say you can't yeah. do it. Um, I like the big, big to differ. And, you know, I'm just going to run through these people as much as I can. And boop. So look at that. He's, oh no, he's hurt. Oh no, boom. But you just keep going through. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I think we killed somebody. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there he is. We killed a guard. Uh, don't move a muscle, don't worry. Oh, <laughs> no, here goes the horse rampage. <laughs> yeah, you could definitely kill people with horses. People are always saying it's like, oh, you can't kill it without, uh, you go to the strength perk right here. You need to have boar installed, which is supposed to deplete an opponent's health and all that by bumping into them at a sprint. The effect is increased if armor is heavier than theirs. Well, I don't have it right now, so, I mean, we're gonna be answering some questions about yeah. Does this boar needs to be needed to actually kill people? And the answer is no. And you don't even need to have a weapon. You just need to bump into people. Sorry, Sir Hanish. Don't worry. So, you can just keep running through people as much as you want. And, um, they'll eventually die. Usually peasants die within two hits. You just kind of go back here. He's hurt. Ooh. Yeah, there you go. About two hits at full speed, does it? I see a corpse, yes. They do blame you for murder, so um, it's not a perfect way to get away with murder. But you can definitely do that. Guards usually take about two or three hits. <laughs> yeah, the frame rate dies out here. It seems like more horses you have out here, the <laughs> especially... <laughs> Oh, especially the Glitchy Brothers. Um, this is like really the most overpowered strategy of all time because especially in cities when you have all these open streets, nobody could really stop you. Oh, you're going to bring your bow out like that? No. But I think you get the point off how dangerous this can be for the NPCs in the town. You could just wipe everybody out with your horse. No problem at all. Um, so I think the main question is, does... These other perks do help out, like or perk. Do does it actually work out? So let's uh, do some experimenting. So let me yeah. go back in time. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick a target. The target is is this uh, guard right here. Oh he has let's see, basic armor. You know he has padded underneath, chainmail, and a helmet. I picture probably take three hits from full speed to take him out. So let's see. 
So we hit him from behind. We go one. Oh yeah, he looks hurt. And Oh, it only took two hits. And nobody saw that. Alright, um, that guard took two hits, and this is just the power of the horse. Now, I should mention is that my horse now is far over encumbered, uh, so that might have something to do with it. Alright, so let's see. This guy right here, he is pretty similar. So, we can hit him. You got chainmail, helmet, and everything else on. Alright, let's do this. Let's see if the boar perk helps out at all. But I doubt it's gonna help. I mean, two hit kills is pretty, it's pretty gnarly already. So, and what do we just say, boar? So, boar again, post to deplete health. So, and we'll give you a boop. And he's dead in two hits. And nobody cares. I'm leaning more towards is how heavy your horse's pack really is, which is interesting. Let me empty everything out we got from the armor because we got, you know, almost 400 weight here. So let me just drop all this. All right. So the horse is down to the 34 weight. We just dropped like thousands of uh, <laughs> groceries worth of armor just on the floor. Let's see, get you lined up and boom. He's get hurt, but he's not. And he's dead. <laughs> Two hit kills. This is um, ridiculous. So really the perks don't really matter too much it seems. It seems like you can just start murdering people pretty well. What about the other part? What about Henry? Because I have all this armor on. So what if I take this off? Does that change his things? We'll just put Henry down into skeevies. There we go. I'll leave on the I'll leave on the golden spurs because why not? They look utterly fashionable on here. <laughs> it should be fine. Uh, this guy. We'll hit you once. So that's a one good hit. Let's see ya. Two hits again. So it seems like Henry doesn't really matter on his weight or their weight. Alright, so let me go load this back and let's go take a look. Maybe you know, maybe the horse is, you know, the speed matters a lot. Bayard, what is your stuff? So, their speed is only 36, 260 carry capacity. Those are heavier carry capacity. Courage and less, uh, yeah. So, let's do this. So, we're going to steal you. So, let's go and let's hit you. That's one hit. And boom. Two hits. I'm guessing speed is probably more of the... Because I can't get a good hit on him, it seems. Boom, get you hit. Get hit. Uh-oh. Ow. Oh, there goes the horse. Someone saw you steal it. Well, you won't forget this in a hurry. Because it'll take a nice time What is going on? <laughs> Henry, what happened? Um. <laughs> yeah, here you go. Oh, well. What can I do? Here you are. <laughs> All right. Just make sure it doesn't happen again. Yeah, look at that. I hit him by four or five Back times, down. and he has still a ton of health. So, ow, ow, ow. Yeah, so it looks like these horses don't do that well. Um, you can kill people still with regular horses. They're just slow. Um, so let's go for something else. Let's go for the war horse Jetta. So their speed is 41 versus 56 without like any like improvements you should say so the speed's a little bit better and we'll hitch this guy up let's see hit him in the back uh we're gonna come back give you a nice little head start it seems like speed is probably i think speed's probably the most determining factor here about what uh determines you killing people because you go really fast you can actually like I like how this guy just doesn't doesn't care. Um, yeah. So that was that four hits. Yeah. So I think that overall, if you want to kill people with your horse, it's really determined about speed. So I also have race horse on, which is probably adjusting the speed of the horses. So I think basically what you want to do is get your horse as fast as possible, and 
it sounds kind of counterintuitive, but you don't want to have, you know, horse armor on because horse armor, though it gives you like two, nine, and two, it slows you down by five. So you want to basically make your horse as fast as possible to be able to do these kind of damages to people because two hit kills to guards is pretty darn good. So, I mean, yeah, you can't really ask for more, so. Once you get to like 50, 55 around there, it looks like it's three to four hits. So depending on your speed, it's gonna take a little time. Um, so anyways, I think that's good enough for now. Uh, you know, we'll leave the horse cancel here to decide the fate of everybody else. Uh, but you know, that's fine. You know, they can sit here and enjoy a good show here out in the middle of Rat Tay Square and they'll be here forever because, um, you know, selling their goods <laughs> slowly. Oh, good god. Um, I love this game sometimes. But anyways, yeah, I think that's good enough for now. I'll just, you know, take a look and see other things. Because it seems like some people didn't think you could kill people with horses, but yes you can. And how can you do it? Well, get a really fast horse. Fast horse matters. Do you need the board perk for it? No, you don't. You don't need anything except the speed. Yep. I have no idea where he's going, to be honest. He's... Being crowd. <laughs>